so we have a three and a five year old and um, we fell into the habit of laying next to them when it was time to go to sleep. And, you know, we tried lots of different things and different methods and it, it a lot of it happened in that transition from crib to big kid bed yeah. and we were exhausted. So we just, let's just lay next to them until they fall asleep. And then we super quietly sneak out. Um, and we knew at the time, like at some point that was going to bite us, but it, <laughs> we were so tired. So right, you're we in just, survival mode. <laughs> right. So we just made it work and fast forward. I don't even know how long we've been doing that for you know and and it it wasn't just that it was then they'd wake up in the middle of the night in order to go back to sleep they would need one of us in there so it would end up where you know we maybe could sneak out after they initially fell asleep and go back to our room watch a show read a book do whatever but then we'd always end up back in their room and we'd always wake up in one of their beds so it was just so my, you guys were like playing musical beds throughout the night. Yeah. Yeah. Like there were nights where I would, or mornings I would wake up and I was like, oh, look at that. I slept in three different beds last night. <laughs> like something from your site popped up and I was like, ooh, I want to take that class. And I'm pretty sure like I literally clicked on it and like listened to it like an hour later. Like I was, it, the timing, right. yeah, the timing worked out perfect. And I was like, I'm going to do this over my lunch break. And, um, I did. And I was like, everything you said, I was like, yep, that's me. Yep. Oh, yep. That's me too. And I <laughs> felt like you were in my house. I was like, <laughs> oh my gosh, that's crazy. <laughs> so yeah. So then I not convinced, but told my husband like, all right, here's kind of the plan, but we both have to stick with it. Cause this is an investment. And he was like, nope, that's totally fine. He enjoys laying down with our daughter and falling asleep with her like that's great I don't enjoy that that's not my jam so he did it anyways um and we started our falling asleep both of them are falling asleep so much faster on their own like James my son used to take the five-year-old he used to take anywhere from like 30 minutes to like an hour and a half to fall asleep so like you'd be sitting there or laying there and it's like it's okay is it time you can fall asleep yet yeah right and so they both now um fall asleep pretty I would say within like 20 minutes on their own in their beds um it's like not even a thing anymore like it's you know we don't hear oh I want you to lay with me and my daughter used to at least wake up at least one time a night and come like flying down the hallway and we don't that hasn't happened in a long time she um she sleep like oftentimes during the week I have to wake her up to like get going in the morning for so she's falling asleep in 20 minutes and she's sleeping yep. all the way through the night you're not seeing her at all correct and it's like the, the greatest thing ever because I used to always have that anxiety of like all right when am I going to hear her run down the hallway or when am I going to wake up and she's like standing there staring at you you know <laughs> so yes it she yeah we don't see her either until she gets herself up at like 6 30 ish and she'll come out the door otherwise like today I had to wake her up at seven o'clock and I was that's awesome so you're able to sleep better because you don't have to sleep with one ear open anymore correct yes and that's been huge I definitely sleep better for sure and they that's sleep awesome. better so that's, that's the most great. important yeah, yeah.